How big is this? Can compare it. Like the look, the, like look I, at the size of it. My body size. It's like half of you. Bro, how is it <laughs> so big? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> it's like I ordered a bed or something, bro. <laughs> like at the end of the day, it's just a computer. An IKEA bed. Bro, this piece is, it's taller than my desk. I might have to like have it separately, but then again, it could be cool to just have a massive PC chilling right here, just looking that would be dope. sick. Because this, this thing, obviously the specs are insane. I'm gonna go over them in a little, but it looks pretty cool too, you know? It looks really cool. We got like lighting. Oh my God, bro, let's unbox it. How excited are you? Really excited. Having a new PC is the best, and this is by far the craziest piece I've ever had. Insane. Oh my God, bro. Digital Storm, you already know. They really hooked it up, guys. They really hooked it up with this one. Oh my god, it is this tall, bro. Jeez. James, could you come for one second? We need your help. The PC is too big to get out of the box. No way. Can you record? No way. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Right, here we go, bro. Damn, dude. Look at that, bro! That's a piece Ooh. of it. Yes. Okay, let's flip it. It's upside down, but... Digital <laughs> Storm killed it. This is by far craziest PC I've had, guys. What? Oh my god, bro! It's so big! <laughs> <laughs> Look at this side, though. This Whoa. is the sick side. That's what I'm saying. It's wide open. I mean, you can't really tell now, but once we get this out, it's gonna look insane. There's so much lighting and cables. Actually insane. Yo. Oh my God, are you kidding me? What the heck? What's, this liquid What's that, bro? That's, um, that's like the fluid for the water cooler for the CPU. Oh, nice. oh my God. What's this computer? Actually, Digital Storm, what did you guys do? I'm gonna go over the specs in a little. Can we just look at this first? Oh my what? god. It looks like an engine from like a car or something. I think all of these light up as well. Like these are all gonna be in color. Can't wait to start this. But for now... Why do you have a car engine sitting in your room? Right? <laughs> right? This is too sick to not flash. I don't care guys, you can call me flashy, bragging, whatever. That's, that's gonna be put right here so everyone can see. It's not gonna be hidden under my desk. It's too beautiful to put under a desk. Yeah. You don't wanna hide this thing. I might even buy a second, like, small desk and put it on top of here. Yeah. I don't even know how this is a computer. That's ridiculous. Like, this is like, I told you guys, I'm gonna go to space for this thing. I'm telling you. <laughs> Yo, oh my God. I think that light up and stuff too. Like, yeah, that this works. is all gonna be light up. Wow. I know, it's really upstairs. Wow. So I'm mind blown. Like, Digital Storm, I didn't even know you could do this with computers. <laughs> this is like barely a computer this at, at, level, at this dude. point. It's insane. Sitting down to your morning coffee, turning on your home computer to read the day's newspaper. Well, it's not as far-fetched as it may seem. In fact, both local San Francisco papers are investing a lot of money to try and get a service just like that started. Science editor Steve Newman reports on one person already using the brand new system. I have a remote for my computer. What? How are you gonna have a remote for your computer? I can change. No, is it full RGB remote? This is, yes, bro. It's lighting no, and everything. Oh my god, this is gonna. Oh. So now I have this and guys, my colored lights. My room is about to be a club. It's been the club. It, uh, bro, it's been a club. It's about to be the most legit club ever. Are you kidding me? Let's plug this in and just see. Oh my yeah. god. I might buy a little, little table and put it here. For now, let's have it like that. Let's plug him in. Oh my god. Look at the size of that, like actually, it's insane. This piece, oh my God, Digital Storm, I can't, can't thank you guys enough, this is insane. Like this, I told you guys before, I've said it so many times already. Is this even a computer at this point? I have a remote. I have two remotes. They're not even the same. <laughs> Why do I have two remotes? <laughs> this is not real. This is actually not real. 
Oh my God. This is like actually the coolest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. And this is just standing in my room. I hope this is doing justice for you guys on camera. Cause this is just unbelievable. Oh my God. So like, what do I do? Like what side? Like obviously this side is a little bit cooler, but I'm not really trying to just waste this. <laughs> we'll move your carpet down. <laughs> Bro, I can't get over how sick this computer is. Oh my god! I actually can't believe this is in my room. I'm so happy to have this. I'm sorry guys, I'm gonna go over the specs really really soon, but this is just very very aesthetically pleasing to just sit and look at. Like, this is amazing. Amazing. Yo, you ready for something insane? Most satisfying thing, just look at this, okay? Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> it's so <laughs> sick! Wow. Yo, that's beautiful, dude. What? And we have two remotes for it. <clears throat> All right, guys, so now that it's up there, Let's just go over some specs, all right? I've just been freaking out by the looks of it, but obviously it's gonna perform as well. This thing has a i9-7900X 10 core processor, which is water cooled by one of the most insane water coolings I've ever seen. The cables, the colors, the lights, everything is just perfect. Me editing on this is gonna be the greatest thing ever. There's no lag, it's gonna be amazing. Like the i9, when I saw a commercial about it, it was literally made for 4K editing. I actually shoot in 4K. I don't render in 4K, but editing 4K, so the files are really big. Editing on this is just gonna be insane. I know a lot of people are gonna say, oh my God, that's so overkill, you only play CS. I do edit all my videos. I do a lot of like video stuff. So having a really good computer, especially a processor, is gonna help me a lot with the editing. So it's, this is not just for me to have good FPS in CS, guys. It's like way more than that. I actually use it every single day for work, for editing, etc. So i9 is gonna be sick. For the graphics card, we got a GTX 1080 Ti 11 gigabytes graphics card. Even if it's not just for it, I think it's gonna be pretty sick to play CS on this thing. I'm not gonna <laughs> lie, like the 1080 was like, when I wanted a new PC, I was like, I need that 1080 Ti. So this is amazing. Just the placement of that as well. Insane, man. Oh, wow, wow. It also got a one terabyte NVMe SSD. It's Guys, all the specs are gonna be in the description. This thing is an absolute beast. It's a monster. I can't wait to plug it in. I can't wait to play on this thing. I can't wait to edit on this thing. Once again, for all the PC people out there that are gonna tell me that this is major overkill or this is this or this is that, this is meant for so much more than just playing some CS. Like this is just meant for long-term consistent insane performance. So I never have to worry about editing or rendering or playing. I can do it all and hopefully for a long time. And why not get the best of the best and have it for longer than getting something half made and then having to switch in a year. So Digital Storm, appreciate you. You truly, truly hooked it up. This is the most insane computer I have ever seen. The specs are insane. The specs will be in the description down below. Digital Storm will be in the top link in the description. Go check their stuff out. This is they really know what they're doing. This has to be the best and coolest build I have ever seen, actually. Not being biased, this is insane. In tomorrow's video, I'm gonna plug it in and I'm gonna let you guys know what it's like playing CS on it and whatnot. I'm gonna have a little part of that in my video tomorrow when it's all plugged in. I'm gonna try and figure out and buy some kind of like a smaller, lower table-ish and have it just centered here in this corner. Because as James said, this is an art piece. This is way too beautiful and aesthetic looking to be hidden under my desk. Like, I can't do that to it. Sure, you can't hide it, bro. You got you, we, we literally can't. We have to put it out there. Right there. We have to display it. We have to treat it as an art piece and treat it with the, with the respect it deserves. So I'm gonna try and find a little something to put here. So it's basically up in the air a little bit and just more leveled with the setup and just in the corner. And I think it's gonna look absolutely insane. Once again, shout out Digital Storm. Truly appreciate it. Specs in the description. Thank you. Drop a like on this video if you enjoyed. I'll be back with a brand new video tomorrow. Thank you. I love you. Phase up. Oh my God! Bro, there's water and everything. <laughs> this is not real. This is actually not real. Oh my God.